Good day everyone, today we will teach you on how to remotely access your device for the version 5.1.2 using Dataplicit. First, open your browser and go to dataplicity.com. After that, you will have to input an email address so that you can access your device remotely. After providing your email, click Start and then wait for the code to appear. You can copy it so that you can also access your terminal and then click Done. Once you click Done, a verification code will be sent to your email. Please go ahead and open it so that you can verify your account. After you click Verify, you will then be routed back to your website where you will be asked to set a password so that your account will be secure. And you see that the password is already set. Now you will have to go and connect to your device so that you can install the Dataplicity remote access onto your machine. And once you are connected, please go to the admin dashboard by typing 10.0.0.1 slash admin. After that, go to plugins and go directly to Dataplicity plugin. Input the email and the password that you have used in registering your account earlier on the website. Once you're done providing the details, click Install and wait for the machine to completely install Dataplicity plugin on your device. After the installation is complete, a prompt will show up on the lower right side and you will also have to enable Dataplicity first before you can use it on your device. There should also be a video tutorial on how you can access your device remotely on the lower side, but first let us do it manually. Let us now go back to dataplicity.com and see if we can access our device. And since we are already signed in on dataplicity.com, it showed us directly what devices is available that we can access remotely. And on this side, we can access your device's terminal. You just need to input the code that was saved earlier. And when you enable the wormhole on the right side, there should be a link where you will have to click so that you can also access your admin dashboard. And once you click it, you will see that you will be routed to the login page of your admin dashboard. Just type your password and username for this one and click login and as you can see it is successful you can now access all of your adobe isoft machines using dataplicity remotely this works on ubuntu servers on your orange pi and all your raspberry pi devices and thank you for watching, that's all for today. See you next time for our updates and new features. Bye-bye.